Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. So tonight I'm uh, in Hyde. It's about half seven in the evening and touch wood. Hopefully tonight I'll be photographing the badger. Uh, the owner of the Hyde has been uh, putting peanut butter and nuts and peanuts and stuff like that out uh, to attract in the badger. He's got some footage of the badger coming in on the trail cam. So I've come down tonight now to try photograph that badger. Also, uh, he sighted a long-eared owl coming in, uh, picking off the uh, mice and rats that are eating the nuts at night. So there's a long-eared owl and the badger coming in here at night. As I said, it's about half seven, quarter to eight now. It's starting to get dark. So I'm all ready. I have the flash set up. I have um, my camera settings all set up. And I'm just going to turn off the light, get comfortable, and to pray to God this badger comes in. I've never photographed the badger, and I have a, I have a spot in my house on the wall where I'm going to put up a badger photo whenever I get one. So I hope tonight's the night. And I've never even seen a badger in the wild up close, only from a distance. So anyway, I'm going to stop rambling on. Um, I'm going to turn the light off get nice and quiet and uh, wait a few hours and see if this badger comes in. Oh, so what a night, huh? It's um, it's about one o'clock in the morning, and uh, the badger, the badger showed up once, but I had the flash pointed up at the tree for that long-eared owl. So 
I missed the badger. But he came in. He was sniffing around. And uh, stupidly, 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 um, I got up to move the flash to point down at the badger instead of up at the long eared owl. And uh, I made some noise with the bench and uh, scared the badger off. That was at about 10 o'clock. So it's one o'clock now and he hasn't come back. So safe to say, I don't think he's gonna come back till the morning to get some food. But I got the long-eared owl. Ah, oh, what a beautiful bird. Uh, the, the orange eyes and big fluffy feathers and uh, he was diving, he dived two or three times uh, to pick up some of the mice. Uh, tried to get some shots of him diving but they were just out of focus. Um, but I got some nice stills of him up on the branch. The photo was a bit busy with other branches and leaves in the way so I probably just blackened them out. Um, oh, I just can't get over that long eared owl. Absolutely gorgeous. I got some footage as well that just and uh, I'm just in awe. But um, I'm disappointed about the badger. I uh, I should have I should have let him settle and then kind of moved the flash. But uh, you know it's like it just got super excited and it didn't work out for me. But anyway, anyway guys, thanks for watching. It's pretty late. I'm very tired and I have a long drive home. So I'm gonna let you go. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. I'll be putting everything over on the Instagram page as always. Uh, Sean Mead Photography. So I'll be putting some of the photos up there. And uh, the uh, I just I keep looking out because the badger, but he's not going to come back now with me talking and everything. So anyway, I'm rambling. I'm going to head home because I'm wrecked tired. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm sure I'll see you on the next one.